by Cinderia Burhat has introduced the NASA Blade TBR 2013 edition, available in 650cc and 250cc variants. The NASA Blade TBR 2013 edition has been jointly developed by U.S. Base 2 Brothers Racing and NASA bikes with racing performance and good aesthetics in mind. Today, this event is basically the unveiling of our partnership with Two Brothers Racing and NASA Bikes, where we produce two bikes today, the 650 Blade TBR and also the 250 Blade TBR. Okay, today is actually the launching of um, the new TBR edition for 2013 for NASA Blade 650 and 250. I mean, it's exciting times. As you know, our partnership with TBR has been there for about two years now. And this is the first brainchild, so we are moving forward from here into other exciting things. And again as well, you know, we are doing the launch at our plant, at our facility here. It's our own facility, produce about 40,000 bikes, you know, capacity about 40,000 bikes. We're expanding it, we're talking about, you know, exciting times for NASA bikes moving forward. How these things will actually, um, TB, um, NASA bike is the first distributor for TBR Asia. And through discussion, and it took us at least a year, through discussion and good relationship with uh, NASA Bike, we came up with this smart partnership would bring value to us and the customer as well. The NASA Blade TBR edition is a stylish upgrade of the original model which boasts a signature Two Brothers Racing High Performance Exhaust System that is lighter than the standard exhaust and increases the bike's horsepower by 5%. TBR is actually a sole distributor for um, Two Brothers Racing. We are already uh, authorized. We are the authorized sole distributor uh, last year in October 2011. The engineering works is actually um, done by NASA Bikes uh, engineer itself, and it's only the Two Brothers Racing we do um, all the decals, um, the the fittings, the how how it looks like, and the carbonize. Everything is only done by us. The NASA Blade TBR Edition sports custom design decal, a bold library with a TBR logos, strong colors and edgy designs line. Other upgrades include a newly designed seat and an upgraded brake line. However, this is only available for the NASA Blade 650R TBR 2013 Edition. Okay, basically the 650, as you know, I mean, when it comes to the TBR, the improvement in terms of the horsepower is about 6 to 7 horsepower. This is the first tier. The second tier, we are working with the R&D to come up with their own issue. It's called the juice box that will increase the horsepower to about 10% of the current horsepower that it has. We're going to do lightweight, I mean, to make, it, to make the bike lighter, you know, to do the warming series, races for all that. You know why we're doing this at this sector because you know we at this sector blade is a market leader we control about 60 percent of the market share of the 250 and 650 but we do have customer who wants you know that you know we want something more quicker more powerful look trendy but it's not for everyone so the target for this tbr blade is basically 10 percent of the total market share of blade so we're targeting about 4005 next year so about 450 to 400 units of blade TBR will be sold next year. The first bike will be out, inshallah, in January. We have our online social media platform ready on board to promote this. People can go online, get to know about the bikes better. They can book online. They can put their deposits online. So whoever is interested in the bike, now is the time for you to go online, visit TBI Asia and other bikes, and you can actually be the first few owners to own the bike. The bikes, a result of a partnership with a TBR Asia, come with a one-year limited warranty. TBR Asia was appointed Malaysian distributor for Two Brothers Racing in October 2011. Two Brothers Racing is noted for its aftermarket exhaust system and high-performance accessory for bikes. NASA Blade, meanwhile, is the product of a technology collaboration with South Korean motorcycle maker Hyo Song. The NASA Blade at 250cc sports bike has been the best seller in the market since 2011, capturing almost 50% market share with over 120 units sold monthly.
The blade basically uh, they are all the starters. You know, they, these are the starter uh, bike when it comes to the category of super bikes. So most of them are first time uh, executive, I mean owners, I mean the step up from you know from the regular motorcycles going up. And then this is something which is uh, very interesting because there's an upsurge in terms of uh, target market because the pricing of our bike is very interesting, 21,000, a lot of people can afford it. We are financing it for it, we are financing for them and then we are extending you know, the, the, the platform to a lot more people. So we are very confident that we can achieve 4,500 unit sales next year. Naza Bikes has set a target for sales of the 250cc Naza Blade at 2,400 units to take on a 60% of the market share. To expand production capacity, Naza World is investing 500,000 ringgit in a new production line for the Naza Blade range that is expected to be ready by March. Yeah, that is our our plan. As you know, you know we are doing all this development. Actually, it's not for the Malaysian market. There's a lot of interesting things happening in Vietnam, in Indonesia. As I mentioned to you earlier just now as well, you know, blade market, you know, we're talking about the 650 market. In Indonesia, it's about 60,000 sales a year. If you could do 10% of that, it's about 6,000 units. So it'll be bigger than in Malaysia. Both combined, inshallah, we can do about 10,000 units of blade. That's being there. And you know, Vietnam, you know, Vietnam is a habitual thing. Everybody is on motorcycle. Everybody's on motorcycle because when they grow up, the first thing they buy is motorcycle. But they're successful, they buy bigger bikes. So we also identifying the second biggest bike market in the region is actually uh, Vietnam. So the total market for motorcycle within the region is about 13 million. So my challenge to the team is basically, in whatever ways that we do, we must capture 10% of the total sales volume of the region under NASA bikes. The 250R and 650R based on the recently launched NASA Bikes Blade are priced at 18,000 ringgit and 26,000 ringgit respectively. Besides the NASA Bikes brand, NASA World sports a long list of established brands such as Harley Davidson, Ducati, Aprilia, Vespa, Gilera, and Piago and an Indian motorcycle and is currently exploring its local production capabilities. SM Faisal also said another bike is planning the local assembly of one of the international brands currently in its stable. So are you We are focusing very much on Malaysian market, yes, that's our primary market, but we are looking at regional market. As you know, NASA represents Harley Davidson, Ducati, Aprilia, Vespa, Gilera, Piaggio, Victory. We are signing up another two more brands, inshallah, soon. And uh, with that, with the principle that we have, again, being Asia is a place to be now, we are working with them to work out a different business model, how we want to address all these markets. The markets which I, had, I mentioned to you earlier, Indonesia, Thailand, Myanmar, Laos, you know, Philippines, all these markets is actually open to us, even Brunei, to the smallest market. So we are working with them. We are about to finalize a few things for that market. Even even from Malaysia now, we are finalizing one big brand from Malaysia for to do CKD brands, to do NASA branded products as well. So, I mean, as a two-wheel, I'm very, very excited because I'm both telling my team, and we've been headed by, you know, Nick Daniel, our VP for two wheels, you know, and the team are all very motivated. We all would like to grow the business, and we see it could be a leapfrog even for the group in terms of sales volume, in terms of the reach within the region and creating a very sustainable economy where people, everybody can benefit. I think that's very important.